Good morning, Year 6. It's Mr Nicholson here for the final English lesson of the term. I'd like you to pause your um, video screens, please, and write down the date and title of today's lesson. So it's Friday the 12th of February, and the title is Creative Story Writing. And there's a second title to write because we're going to write a story this morning called Museum Adventure. Okay, pause the video and come back to the screen when you're ready. Okay, welcome back everybody. So here is a little bit of a clue about the story we're going to write this morning. Um, it's the Egyptian scarab beetle. And what we're going to do is I've started writing a story for you and I'd like you to carry it on um, and get your imaginations going and continue the story um, and think about what might happen to the character. So I'll read the story through to you. I've had a go at writing this this morning um, and this is what I've got so far. Every year, Year 6 went to visit the City Museum, and this year was no exception. The guide stopped at each display, but it was only when they reached the Egyptian area that Emily became interested. Fascinated, Emily stared at the exhibit whilst her classmates walked on. A scarab beetle caught her attention. Greens and blues shimmered like a gemstone, and elongated feelers stretched outwards. Emily was swiftly grabbed and magically transported to the world of the ancient Egyptians. Okay, so that's where I've got to so far. Um, I chose to use the character Emily, but if you want to change the character's name or change it from a girl to a boy, you can. And I wanted to put my character all alone, so that's why I had her looking at the exhibit whilst her classmates carried on. And then this scarab beetle came alive and took Emily um, into the magical world of the ancient Egyptians. So she's travelled back in time. What I'd like you to do this morning, and if you want to write this paragraph out, you can do in your English books, or you could just start the story from here, um, I don't mind, it's up to you, is I want you to continue the story on to its conclusion, to its ending. Have a little bit of a think about where Emily uh, could be taken to and what it might look like. What events could happen when she gets back to ancient Egypt? Who could she meet? Could you link it to some of the characters you've been learning about in your topic lessons? So maybe Emily could meet someone like King Tutankhamun. Think about how you're going to write your story so that Emily is able to get back to the museum and back to her friends. And then when she does get back, how are her friends going to react to her story? Are they going to believe her or not? This is, a great, uh, um, this is a great chance for you just to get your imaginations going this morning and be creative with your writing. Uh, take the story wherever you want it to go, carry it on from here, from the ellipse, and then when you're finished, send some photos of your stories into your class teachers uh, because I know that we'd all love to read them. Okay, Year 6, I hope you enjoy writing your stories this morning. Can't wait to see what uh, God Reby have written. Look forward to it. Um, Great to speak to you. Uh, thanks for tuning in um, and have a great day. Bye, everybody.